Hey y'all, it's Paris and I'm back with another video. God is saying that you are upset and worried about too many things. This could be your bills. This could be, you know, worried about how God is going to provide. This could be worried about, you know, um, getting a job. And so I'm going to be coming from Luke chapter 10, starting at verse 39. And it says, her sister Mary sat at the Lord's feet, listening to what he taught. But Martha was worrying over the big dinner she was preparing. She came to Jesus and said, Lord, doesn't it seem unfair to you that my sister just sits here while I do all the work? Tell her to come and help me. But the Lord said to her, my dear Martha, you are upset over all of these details. There is really only one thing worth being concerned about. Mary has discovered it and I won't take it away from her. So as you can see, Martha has invited Jesus over to her home, okay? And so Martha begins to, you know, start to pre prepare this big dinner. And as she is preparing, she's realizing all the things that she has to do. And she's looking over at Mary and she's seeing that Mary is just sitting there at Jesus' feet. And so to her, it looks like Mary isn't doing anything. But in Jesus' eyes, she's sitting there absorbing everything that God is teaching her. And so here's the thing. Maybe you're just like Martha to where you're trying to do all these things for God. You're trying to do ministry. You're trying to do YouTube. You're trying to go to school. You're trying to pay your bills. You're trying to do everything that God is asking you to do. Yet you feel like you need help. Yet you feel like you don't have everything that you need. God is saying you are worrying about too many things. And you're upset because you're trying to do everything in your own strength. You're trying to figure out, God, how is this going to get paid? How is this going to get done? How am I going to do this, God? It needs money. It takes money for this, God. And God is saying, if you can just sit still, if you have a chance to sit with God, that's the only thing that you should be concerned about. Maybe you are unemployed right now. Maybe, maybe God has isolated you, okay? Maybe he has isolated you to the point to where you feel like, okay, God, what am I going to do now? You have the chance, just like Mary, to sit at his feet. I know that you don't want to look at it like that, but you have the chance to sit at his feet. You have the chance to spend more time with him. God has given you the privilege to spend more time with him. Remember the times where you were working? Remember the times where you were wishing that you had more time with Jesus? And now that you have it, you're still complaining? And so this is what... Uh, Martha was doing she was looking at Mary just looking at her thinking that oh she's just sitting there no she's not just sitting there she's sitting there in God's presence she's sitting there getting the 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 plans from God she's sitting there getting the next strategies from God okay because when you sit in his presence he gives you the the, the next he will tell you what to do next if you sit at his feet okay and so I hope and I pray that you guys are getting this message and I pray that you guys sit at the Lord's feet just like Mary. Sit at the Lord's feet and wait for him to tell you what to do next. Wait for him to tell you what to do next so that you don't have to worry like Martha. So that you don't have to have all these little things in your mind. God, I got to do this. God, I got to do that. He's like, just, just be in my presence. We're going to get to those things. We're going to fix your dinner. We're going to eat your food. But can you just sit in my presence, Martha? Can you sit in my presence for a minute? Okay? So I hope that this has encouraged you guys. If this has encouraged you guys, I encourage you guys to like and subscribe. And if you guys would like to book a coaching session with me or if you guys would like to become a um, certified life coach, please email me and my information will be at the end of this video. All right? Bye, y'all.